Hello and welcome back to Dark Souls 3. Here's three loaders into the mad. Now, we're looking a bit bloody because that's what happens in this game when you kill things. You just end up coated in blood, and you won't actually be able to tell what skin your character has. Like, you could be, you know, whatever. You can be blue. You can actually be blue in this game, but it won't matter because you'll just look. Blood, it's red anyway, because you'll be caught to the blood. Holy King Bluffer, the last hope of his line. Huh. I think I'm gonna mention that. Watchers of the Abyss. Are they all supposed to sit on this one throne? Because there's a lot of them, probably. Yorn the Giant, the profane captain. He has a big chair. Which is big. It's a big chair. Love left exiled and Saint Andrew of the Deep. Now, at first I didn't notice him sitting here. I was just wandering around, minding my own business, not having a single idea that there was already someone sitting on a throne. All that unkindled and a seeker of lords. I am Ludlith of Corland. Look not in bewilderment, as I say. I linked the fire long ago, becoming the Lord of Cinder. If substantiation be thy want, set thine eyes upon my child course. This sad cadaver, no need to be coy. Have a closer look. No thou of our purpose. Five thrones will take five lords as kindling for the linking of the fire. The fast fading flame must be licked to preserve this world. A reenactment of the first linking of the fire. So it is, I became a lord of Cinder. I may be but small. But I will die a colossus. No style of a fuck a I'm That's interesting, thank you. Now now. Do not be away over long. That's interesting. I didn't get a dialogue before with him because I wasn't I didn't talk to him first, I guess. I traveled around for a while before I first found him. So yeah. The don't you get that I don't have the stats for. Alright, well how do these shields compare? This is heavier but other than that, better in any way, every way, even. So I think I'll grab that for now. I should still have a light roll. Yeah. A pleasure to make thine acquaintance, Ashen One. I am but a humble handmaid of the shrine. Weapons, armor, trinkets, and spells. I've lots of little things to ease the burden of a weary traveler. And yes, I'm undead too, but... Not so charitable as to give my goods away. Ashen One, fetch souls and bring them to me. As is thy want, no? <laughs> now, she sells some sorcerers and some miracles and tools to custom and chainmail. And some shields, as well as some weapons. Uh, nothing of the sort that I would require, though. Or desire, at the, this point in time. Her key, though. I will want her key, but it will be a while before I can get that. Unless I Ashen don't level up and I just try and sure find more souls. More souls. Oh. <laughs> Oh yes, and she wishes for souls. Hello. Well, a newcomer, I see. 
I am Andre. I serve at this shrine as a humble smith forging weapons. You're in search of the Lords of Cinder, I trust. A toilsome journey, I wager. You'll require good arms. Let me smith your weapons. I am a smith. Such is my purpose. And this is Andre. Whom you may remember from the good old days of things. Right, uh, I don't have enough time and a chance to do anything at him, his place, or, you know, any broken equipment or anything like that. I can change this though, which I may, though, actually no, because I don't have any healing miracles yet, which is something that's... Weapons and protection are sturdy enough by and large, but when overused, they'll eventually break. When their durability is low, repair becomes a necessity. Use a powder, or simply rest at a bonfire. But should chance impel them break, bring them me. I'll hammer them back into shape. They take no pleasure in breaking, I assure ye. So handle them with care, if you would. I was about to say that I don't have any miracles for healing myself yet, which is... Something that would benefit from having more Ashen Flasks, because, in general, the amount of um, focus points, I guess, you can have, is more than enough to heal yourself in, like, quite a few SS Flasks worth. So it's, like, it's usually useful. There are two ways to smith weapons. Simple reinforcement is one, and infusion the other. Reinforcement is straightforward. It strengthens a weapon without altering its property. Infusion is a more advanced form of smithing that infuses an element. Reinforcement requires titanite, and infusion requires gems. Bring the stones, and I'll do the smithing. It's my purpose, after all. In battle, your weapons are your only friends. Forge them well, and they won't let you down. Hurrah! Ma, another matter. Infusing weapons with gems requires a special kind of coal. My humble coals won't be any use infusing more unusual gems. I know, it's an awful shame, but it's all I have. Please don't give me that look. Believe it or not, I'm quite thin-skinned. <laughs> oh, by the way, if you find any Estus shards, bring them here. They can be used to reinforce either of your Estus flasks. Without those flasks, you'd want for life or focus. And they'll always stay with you. Why not treat them well? Huh? <laughs> Weapons and protect, but when... when Thank but you, and so. that's all. Pretty be careful. I don't want to see my work squandered. <laughs> Alright, uh, this lower floor is currently completely unoccupied, I'm sure, because there's... This is where people come when I discover them. But I currently have not discovered anyone, so I will... You know, not mind that. Ah. And soon enough, we will be going hollow. Probably. Um, alright. I'll talk to this fellow. Ah, another one, roused from the sleep of death. Well, you're not alone. We unkindled are worthless. Can't even die right. <laughs> Gives me conniptions. And they'd have us seek the Lords of Cinder and return them to their molding thrones. 
But we're talking true legends with the metal to link the fire. We're not fit to lick their boots. Don't you think? <laughs> What a sick joke. Asking us to seek the Lords of Cinder and return them to their molding thrones. We're talking true legend. So, there's like always someone in, this, in the hub zone thingy who is just being an ass. Well, not really an ass, just... They've oh, given up. How may I... I didn't talk to you, did I? Ashen one, if my wares are not to thy satisfaction, bring me umbral ash. With ash, I'll fashion new wares. Is it not our sorry fate to sup on death? <laughs> Knowest thou of that soppy gossip? That cordial intrusion lay at the path to embers. And so thou art in need of a soapstone, ashen one. Then thy pockets will overflow with souls to trade to me. <laughs> you are absolutely right. I forgot you actually do send that item. Let let me just grab this white sign soapstone. Thank you. Ashen one, bring with is it? Ash bring is it? That's all she says now. Ash one. Okay. See ya. So now I will talk to her. Welcome to the bonfire, unkindled one. I am a firekeeper. I tend to the flame, and tend to thee. The Lords have left their thrones, and must be delivered to them. To this end, I am at thy side. Ashen One, to be unkindled is to be a vessel for souls. Sovereignless souls will become thy strength. I will show thee how. Ashen One, bring me souls plucked from their vessels. Ashen one. Right. So I'm ashen. Right. Okay. Let's turn it up. Well. Then touch the darkness within me. Take nourishment from these sovereignless souls. Mind you now, there's the small issue of me not actually having lit the fire. Like I'm not sure what she thinks she's doing, but um. All right. Uh, I don't actually think. Upgrading strength is wise right now, but uh, I'll certainly go with more vitality. You know what? What if I actually do just that? Hmm. Uh, no. No, no. But take a little bit of strength as well. But this is how we start off this time. Farewell, Ashen One. May the flames guide thee. I guess I need to start some flames then. Yeah. Ash produce the, the mark of ash to Lothric. I just skipped all of that. Well, may the and okay, well we'll go we'll go forward. We should travel to the high wall of Lofrick. Hmm. I suppose I cannot light the fire in there? No, no I cannot. In instead, I will open this door. And we should... Find the fire down there. Yes. Okay. Cool. Break all the boxes. 
Now this area is a bit scary. I can get over the summer dark spirit to kill me. That's nice. But I'll be honest with you, I have no intention of having a brick hit me already. Uh. Now, the correct way to go is that way, I think. Like, that's the path onwards. But, like, there's stuff this way. And this will be the path to a shortcut later on. I'm surprised that guy over there hasn't noticed me yet. Or oh, that guy over there. Oh, boy. But I can only hope they don't notice me together. This dog... This dog wasn't as happy to die as quickly as the other one. Alright, no, this guy noticed me now. Oh, I shouldn't have done that. I should have dodged. But the fact is, we survived. Oddly enough. Oh, and... Uh... Die. Just so he doesn't do anything creepy. Like, sneak up on me. Oh, there's another one here. Like, I don't want them to do anything creepy. I don't know if they do creepy things, but I'm... I'd rather not find out. Oh! Hello. These people fight well. Surprisingly. Uh, but I think that's so do I. I'd mind you there's like something really creepy here. Oh it's that one! No, 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 no! Oh Whew. I was really worried there for a second. Whew. Like, they just go... really mean. I can't describe how mean they can get. Like, they just... straight up murder you. If you give them the chance. Uh, I can't go over there. As you can see, that's... Uh, not as detailed an area, so it's obviously not real. Well, obviously not discoverable, at least. Backstabs for everyone. Even your friends. Don't backstab your friends. They'll not like it. Indeed, they may dislike it. Because it's rude. It's very, very rude. Ah. Right. And right, they killed the one of the fellows down here, so it's some of this fellow now. And and then there's this, which uh, which doesn't open from the side, so it doesn't matter. All in all, this path was not as rewarding as I remember. I thought there was a point to going up there. Maybe it's because I misremember something? I don't know. No, no, you, no, no being rude. I 
intelligent, no being rude. And honestly, fighting me is rude. Oh shit, right. Now, this guy luckily did not do anything too stupid. Stupid being smart in his case. Oh, that was dumb. Uh, like, he can actually aggro the entire zone, which he did not seem to do, so I'm thankful, I guess. Hello. Come at me, bro. That's, that's not what I mean. No, just fight me. Thanks. That wasn't really a fight, but, you know. Thanks. Anyway. Right, you're just brain here, so I'll be dead. You're dead, yes. I meant you'll die. Alright, and I think I will call it here for this time. But, um, this fucker is terrifying. But anyway, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.